You speak, but all I hear are lies! You dishonor yourself, Timothy. If you are the rat, then wear it proud! I would have respect for that, and with respect comes mercy. Greetings, Wayne. Come with me. As a fellow apostle of technology, I thought you might appreciate this. Vane and I were acquiring components for a device I'll need once we get to the Black Site. Device? Yes, an ice explosive for the fire failsafe we anticipate encountering. That isn't the impressive detail. As we ran into interference, I determined I would be more efficient if I made smaller versions and employed them as projectiles. Who were they? Hindrances. As you can see, it's been wildly successful. Impressive science, Freeze. You'll notice I don't do anything ineffectually, Mr. Wayne. Hear that, Freeze? Wayne is cut out for this life after all, huh? <laughs> Huh. I never would have guessed after he shied away from beating the last man I suspected. One more time, my friend. Why did an alarm go off when it was your job to ensure it didn't? Bane, come on. I, I slipped up. Dangerous time to make a mistake when you knew I was looking for a more. You're trying to slow us down! No! Look, I want to get paid just like you. I got mouths to feed. Man. When the police arrived, you were nowhere to be found! I... You know I'm no traitor. I stood up for you, remember? Come on, man. We have to stand together on this. Just think. Remember? I think Bane's on to something. You're the mole. The hell, man! You son of a bitch! It appears your time is up. What the hell is no, going on no, here? No, 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 no! Merely plugging their leak. God damn it, Bane. You run in your own investigation? You gonna get little business cards printed that say Detective Bane now? Why are you complaining? I didn't get a chance to grill the guy. I'm a trained psychiatrist. What are you? A side of beef with a hunch? I'll find the rat, and I'll deal with it. You can't be trusted to run your men anymore. They're mine now. Got Yours? It? <laughs> I freed them from Santa Prisca! You just killed one. I only shot him. <laughs> Who do you think wins that recruitment war? <laughs> they won't follow you. What do you want, John? Right. The laptop. This seems like the perfect time. You don't know for sure it was him, so now what? They know the cost. I value loyalty above all else. You know who's gonna have a tough time being loyal now? That guy. Just keep her busy. I have to sneak into her office to get it. And uh, it's all yours. Yep, getting it for my old buddy Bruce. And only you. Promise. Sound like a plan. Up top. Yes, that was a good one. Hey, you two. What's going on with you guys? Harley! What a surprise! You guys get me a black site location or not? The answer had better be yes, Harley. We didn't find the location to the black site yet, but we did uncover the code name for whatever you're after. Project Lotus, ring any bells. And what is Project Lotus? What do you want? Shouldn't you be informing your men they work for me now? You? You can't even keep these two from colluding. Pudding? Are you kidding me? He's loyal to a fault. I'm loyal, Harley. <laughs> yeah, definitely. Which is good for you, because you need help. The mole, Bane's men, you... 
maybe, possibly, potentially can't handle it alone. I'm really the only man for the job. Me and only me. You time out! And you, we need to talk. Is one of my favorite toys. Helps me make boring things into pretty things. Can you be a smart guy and guess another one of my favorite toys? Come on, you can do it. Is it John? Oh, look at that. There are some neurons firing in there after all. You two are getting a little too close for comfort. So I'm making a new rule. Hands off. Point is, John's mine, and mine alone. So don't play with my toys, or I'll bash in that pretty face of yours. Alfred, get a suit ready for drop-off. Of course. Was your accomplice successful? Apparently not. What happened? Catwoman got here first. I was hoping you'd catch up to me. I hadn't had a chance to thank you for tipping me off about the GCPD. I didn't expect it. You really saved my ass. If it wasn't for you, the cops would have gotten the drop on me for sure. You should have expected I would. I've helped you before. And it surprises me every time. Now I need you to help me. The laptop. I need you to hand it over. You proved your point. Quite the coincidence that we find ourselves here again. What do you mean, again? We're on top of the mayor's old office. Harvey's old office. Feels like a hundred years ago, doesn't it? Since we had our first chase. So much has happened since then. Yeah, it does. That's the night I saved your life. First time I saw you. We had something then. Same as we do now. A give and a take. <laughs> you want it? Take it. You didn't think it'd be that easy, did you? Oh, come on. That was fun. I'd bring out that wild side of yours. The one you like to keep stuffed down in that suit. The side of you that's just... aching to break free. Yeah, it's a little crazy. But isn't that what you like about me? We both like to live on the edge. It's where we find each other. Maybe it is. Maybe you're just my kind of crazy. And maybe you're mine. Well, have a good night. Selena. Why'd you do it? Run off at Riddler's like that? I wanted to get payback for Riddler. On my own terms. 
for what they did to him. For what he did to you. And just, what are you offering me in return? You're a man of many resources. Make me an offer I can't refuse. Okay, Selena. I'll give you what you want. And what is it you think I want? Something meaningful. With someone who has your back. I've had you already. But who knows? I might be up for a repeat performance. Just promise to work with me. I'll stop playing games. We've had our fun, haven't we? I know I stole from you. And I know I haven't done enough to make that right. I came back to stop Harley's so-called pact. The Eddie I knew would have wanted that. Anything else? Us? That's just icing on the cake. No pressure, really. I'd say it's time to find a black site, partner. We'll probably need our own supercomputer to get into his laptop. But something tells me you might know where to find one. Come home with me. What's at home? You'll see. I thought I'd seen it all when I found you hanging with the sewer rats, Bruce. This place. It's really you. Rich men and their toys. Only thing missing is a wet bar. Make yourself comfortable. I'll try. This place, it's not exactly... cozy. I know how hard it is to let people in. The fact that you've done that... It means a lot to me, Bruce. I didn't give a damn about anyone else until I met you. You're a bad influence on me. Do you really mean that? Don't let it go to your head. It... Being here, with you... I came back to Gotham for a little redemption, but... I didn't expect to find it next to you. It's nice. The way I feel around you, like... Like I can be better. Do you maybe... Feel the same? I'm gonna kiss you now. That's what I wanted. I didn't think this was ever gonna happen. Guess you've proven me wrong. Hold that thought. Is that what I think it is? What is my stuff doing on display in your cave? Alongside mementos of the psychopaths you've locked up? Not that you're normal by any stretch of the imagination, but... And there I am. Right next to Harvey Dent. This has got to be good. It remind me of you. Is that such a bad thing? Uh, did you... want them back? Hold on to them. They look kind of nice there.
tea for two is served. Alfred, thank you. Decryptor detected. Accessing Sanctus Project Lotus files. Retinal scan required. Let's try this again. Access granted. Bruce, whenever you have a moment, I have something to show you. The back computer will scan for viruses and other safeguards before we can have access to the data. I finished up a new feature for your contacts. Lucius nearly completed it before. But, well, I've been fiddling with it to keep myself occupied. Uh, at any rate, your contacts now have the capability to detect heat signatures. Cold, too, because well, with Mr. Freeze, you never know. Thanks. I'm sure it'll come in handy. I'm impressed you felt close enough to someone to welcome them into the Batcave, but I'm curious to know why. What is it about her? Not that I'm judging, mind you. She's important to me. I thought as much. Good for you, Bruce. This is a big step. <sighs> it's done. Sounds like the laptop is safe. Selena. So, what do you think? There's a lot of interesting tech down here. How you did it all, I'll never know. And it's more hospitable than the abandoned subway those maniacs call home. But just barely. So, what do you think is next for us? Romantically, or with Riddler's laptop? <laughs> I don't have a lot of expectations, but I do have some hope. <sighs> it's over 600 horsepower. I shall be upstairs if you need me. Good luck. Look at all this data. Finally, something we can read. Let's see what he knew. <laughs> oh no. Some kind of viral agent from the looks of things. We have to find what they were giving those test subjects. Invoices, schematics, design notes. Riddler must have been talking about the location of the black side. His obsession with data left us an incredibly thorough paper trail. Look at these manifests. 
Bodhi Spa. Strange place for delivery of virus incubators. This must be what Riddler means by hiding in plain sight. Patient 843. 10 milligram injection at 0.01% solution. Patient 844. 10 milligram injection at 0.015% solution. God, what is that? Human test subjects? A biological weapon. This is what Harley wants. 你是我的朋友的朋友 at the Bodhi Spa. Okay, okay. I promise we'll get to the bottom of this. But I need you to trust me. Meet me at Wayne Tower in 15. I'll tell you what I know. Harley was asking if the goggles are ready. I'll go back to the subway, see if I can keep her busy. Thanks, Selena. Benefits of partners. Be safe, Bats. You too. 